Money Morning presents How to Pick the Best Biotech Stocks on the Market in 5 Easy Steps The biotech sector is generating millions for investors every year. By July 27th, the S&P biotech industry was up 35% year-to-date, compared to the S&P 500's 0.44%. At the end of this video, we'll reveal a biotech opportunity poised to deliver more than 1,000% gains in only two years' time. Here are five easy steps to help you cash in on the biotech boom. Step one, analyze the market cap. Stocks with market caps below $250 million can be very volatile. You can find yourself needing to sell with no one to buy, but some large cap stocks over $5 billion have already reached their growth limit. Instead, find a biotech stock between the $250 million and $5 billion market cap range, or find a large cap with a deep product portfolio targeting numerous diseases. Step two, find the average trading volume. A stock's average trading volume is crucial. If shares are not liquid enough, you can't quickly exit the stock. Stocks that trade 350,000 shares a day on average are a good bet. Fewer than 300,000 is dicey territory, and under 200,000 is the Wild West. You'll want to avoid these unless you have a high risk tolerance. Step three, analyze the beta. Beta measures a stock's volatility. A beta of one is equal to the volatility of the market. Higher than one indicates greater volatility than the market while lower than one means less volatility. Long-term investors want stocks with low betas. They move more gradually. Step four, assess the short interest. Short interest is how many shares investors sold short but haven't yet covered or closed out. Short interest rises when markets think a stock will fall and decreases when there's more confidence in the share price. Invest in biotech stocks with a short interest of less than 20%. You can find short interest by using a free stock screener. Step five, analyze the Bollinger Bands. Bollinger Bands are a volatility indicator. They show you a stock's standard deviations from a simple moving average over time. Touching the upper line repeatedly indicates a stock is probably overbought. Time to sell. Touching the lower line repeatedly tells you the stock is oversold. Time to buy. You can set the technicals to show Bollinger Bands on Google Finance. Now we'd like to show you one of our hottest biotech investing opportunities today. This small biotech company is poised to deliver 12 times the return on investment. You see, right now it has an anti-aging product in clinical trials. And we're not talking about wrinkle creams or hair plugs. This is a treatment that can make people younger on a biological level. Within two years, we believe conservatively, this company is looking at revenue growth of 1,141%. Click here to learn more about this company today.